Blue Otoko Radio, a radio station that pays rooms. When you hear something interesting, it can always be playing quietly. A lightning ball comes out of nowhere, it starts to shock, 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 and even more until it explodes. Once it exploded, the logo appears, the white shining glows the logo, and the intro ends. The following program is classification rated PG. It was affected for people to listen as parental guidance by seven-year-olds. Now, on the radio. Hello everyone, welcome to my own official radio series, Blue Otoko Cast. So now you may be wondering, how did you get this idea to make that series in the first place, just to become a video radio? Well, I saw some videos that G4PTV made their series, which is Waffle Cast, Yellow Cast, and many more video casters that we have ever seen in other channels. So we decided to make our own video radio cast series, because why not? I know this is actually very boring for you by not seeing some animations on this video radio cast series, but sorry anyway. We have to put the image only just to make us not boring as always, so you can only hear the audio from this. Anyways, speaking of that, that actually came out of my idea to make those series by myself. So I hope you guys really like the new series I've made for my channel as always. Yo Pedro, what's up? Oh hi best friend, glad to see you here. So I heard that you made an idea from those series just to make it look like a video radio cast series. As what I thought, that idea actually looks very interesting. I wish I could make my own, but it's kinda a little bit tiny hard. Yay, even though I don't make some video radio cast series, but being here is actually very normal, lol. Of course. I cannot believe we have to do this. This is actually great. I'm happy that those series are being reused since then. Hi Bacon. Nice to see you. Oh hi Lindy. Glad to see you here too. Anyway, what brings you here? So, a couple of days ago, I actually found someone that can invite in here as well. I just traveled to United Kingdom. And I found a person that is actually very cool and funny that actually likes memes. She says Luli, El Mao, and many other funny words. So we made a visit for her in the studio right here. Welp, looks like there's a visitor coming. I wonder who could that be? Hey guys, look who's here! Wait a minute, is that Tootie? Konnichiwa Tootie, so glad to see you there in my own videos for the first time. Yep, I just heard that you're making your own video radio series, which is Blue O Tokocast. Wait, who's Tootie CH? I've never heard of her before. Well, Chloe Tootie Hodges is a British DTS YouTuber. I used to watch her videos in 2021 when I was 12. His reaction videos are totally crazy, but in the present day, it's now improved and very calm, because Chloe has been growing up since years ago. Well, that's nice to hear. Welcome to the studio, Chloe. Thanks, Lanluz. Man, that studio looks very good. I know. We've actually made the studio just to make our channel not dying. Even we also tried very hard to build the studio doors. I'm glad that you've actually liked it. This was an idea to build the studio since mid-November 2023. But anyway, do you know what happened to Pedro's stream? Um, no. Well, let us tell you. Yesterday, we were trying to talk more about Andre and DJ the Doc's behavior. Suddenly, some of those spam bots just appear out of nowhere. Pedro has tried to put them on a timeout, but unfortunately, he couldn't handle it. The spam bots are getting too much. This also caused me to leave the stream because it just got went to crazy. Pedro could have just have to make me and Super DJ and Smart Raider. But no, it was too late. Wait, those spam bots did what? Are you kidding me? This is the second time that just happened. First it was Pedro's first stream, and now the first stream of 2024. Like come on, why does the start of live streams gets more worse? 
Pedro just came back to StreamYard nine months ago, and now this tragedy was like this? You've gotta be kidding me. Yeah, but it's alright. Next time, I hope this ban won't happen again, because if this happens one more time when I put mid as Super DJ as a moderator, I'll just quit StreamYard until for the notice because my stream wasn't kinda even secure sometimes. Damn, I actually feel bad about what just happened, bro. Just making sure them spam bots can get banned for messing up your stream or whatsoever. Yeah, but we couldn't agree more as always. Anyway, I have some updates that I want to tell you guys. In case you guys didn't know, Pedro has decided to migrate his archive accounts to his second channel. Why? Because since Pedro's old archive account isn't working anymore, the new archive account now only works for his second channel which has blue Ataco archives, and another reason is that Pedro is not interested with his archive account link on his main channel anymore, because from now on, it will be only linked on his second channel, we hope y'all understand in that case. And here's another statement, requests for episode 69 on MC NGC are now closed. The reason why is because I want to make people not to request too much in Minecraft news gone crazy, because that would take me a lot of time to work on episode 69. Just be patient whenever episode 69 comes in the next few weeks. We can just think about it for something. <laughs> Oh crap. Here we go again. This is just like Lulacast all over again. Oops. I forgot that you can also see randomness in these series as well. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Lou. Uh, okay? That was really weird. Oh well, that's the end of the first episode of Blue Otoko Cast. We'll be back the next Tuesday for a new episode. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you next time. This is Blue Otoko Midori. Peace out and sign off. Blue Otoko Radio is owned by Blue Otoko Studios, Blue Otoko Midori and all content belongs to the respective owners, all rights reserved.